And it's actually nice to have a variety. I'm actually perfectly happy not having everyone in the group on the brink of dying from kidney failure or other things. It's nice to have a variety where some people are working on fat loss and some people are working on arthritis and other people have kidney issues. Uh, you know, it's, I, think that's, I think that's actually really great. I don't have an autoimmune disease, but I'm overweight by a lot. Should I join the group? So the rapid recovery group, while most people do it for health conditions, we do have people who do it for weight. I actually just had somebody message me asking me that, that would it be weird if I joined it for, for fat loss rather than uh, for, for health? Because, well, first of all, being overweight is a health condition, right? Um, but she wanted the assistance of the mindset work. So, uh, so absolutely. The only thing you need to have to be in my group is commitment. You do not need to have a disease. You need to have commitment. So there are people who join my group. We've had people join in the past who didn't have diseases yet, but everyone in their family had it. And they wanted to be the one to stop it. I was thinking of someone where everyone in her family had type 2 diabetes. And she said, I don't want type 2 diabetes. I'm already getting to be overweight. I'd rather do this now and change the course of my life and be an example for my family than wait till I'm sick and do it then. So um, I'm really strict about that. Like when people sign up for my group, what the first things they get is me saying, if this was a mistake, if you're not committed Let's convert this to four weeks so that I can call you. Let's convert this to appointments. Like do this if you're committed because I want everyone who joins to have their life changed forever. For a lot of folks who are struggling with weight loss, they also find that really helpful because whether you're sick or overweight or both, you've got food addictions. You have reasons why you're not eating well and taking care of your body that have nothing to do with not knowing better, but have everything to do with how you treat yourself, how you love yourself. So that work has been very helpful for a lot of people as well. You know, and I, I had someone who was doing that my four week program for fat loss and she was doing amazing. And after losing a bunch of weight, she ate candy and told me it was a reward. And I went, that's not a reward that's sabotage. And I worked with her and we talked through it and discovered that, you know, she had had sexual assaults when she was in her late teens and early twenties. And so losing weight is scary because she might feel more attractive and be more prone to assault. And so we had to process those feelings and help her understand that she's now a grown woman who, will, who can protect herself and she's allowed to live in a healthy body and doesn't have to have that trauma dictate what she does to herself now. Releasing that helped her stay on plan and never do that to herself again. So the emotional work is, is important. So if you, are, if you are overweight and you wanna do a group for that reason, it's a great idea. I mean, Thomas is number one fat loss expert He's there to help as well. This raises your metabolic rate. Um, it is extreme in terms of like you're going to be eating raw foods, but you can do that. You can exercise and you can work through the mental health aspects as well. So again, you don't need to have a disease to do the program. What we want is people who are committed to changing their bodies, their health, their lifestyle. That's what we want. And it's actually nice to have a variety. I'm actually perfectly happy not having everyone in the group on the brink of dying from kidney failure or other things. It's nice to have a variety where some people are working on fat loss and some people are working on arthritis and other people have kidney issues. Uh, you know, it's, I, think that's, I think that's actually really great.